This is Transformer, Dark of the Moon, Bug King promotional toy, Shockwave, and Ironhide. Um, these two uh, came in the back, but uh, with their bodies inside their heads. So uh, I took the liberty to uh, flip out the body for you, so you can see uh, and appreciate all the fine detail that uh, the Burger King staff had put into uh, molding the figure. And just uh, for character accuracy, you can see. Um, well, let's first talk about the head. You can see the Cyclops eye that Shockwave has, and same with the uh, ears. Looks a lot like uh, Batman Begin cow, or, or at least the ear part. And uh, yeah, you can see the uh, uh, the big gun. Same with the uh, energy hose that connect to the um, connect to his back actually. And you can see a lot more detail back here. And uh, uh, even the button is, uh, I mean, totally planned in with the mold. <laughs> you know, I, I, I like that. And same with Ironhide. You can see the wheel on his uh, oh, on his leg. You can see his um, his gun and a missile launcher on his two arm. You can see the the, the part of the truck. Yeah. Uh, on his uh, his shoulder. And same, you know, just like Shockwave, his button is, uh, you know, blends in with the uh, mold. Very cool. And the head is very accurate. You can see the, uh, his eyes are painted blue. Very cool. Actually, very light blue. And uh, I have to say, out of all six toys that I've gotten, these two look the best. Uh, I'm not sure about Shockwave and Hatches. They have another gimmicks. Uh, with them, but uh, these two have the uh, projecting Decepticon and Autobot symbol. So this is where it's gonna come out. So let's turn off my light here. Uh, let's push the button. You can see this one better in the dark, actually. Uh, okay. And the further you put the toy back, the 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 bigger and the better you can see the symbol. All right, I hope you can see that well. And Iron High has the Autobot symbol. Okay, very cool. The further you put the toy back, the more, I mean, the clearer is the the um, the projection gonna become. Excellent. So by now you probably know what I'm gonna suggest doing with Iron High. And if you have, um, if you want, you know, to go back, if you really love the first Transformer movie, you can take out whatever is inside the body and install it into uh, the gun of a Bumblebee figure. Have him, uh, you can reenact that scene that he uh, projected the Autobot symbol up uh, in the sky to uh, signal the arrival of the uh, other Autobots. So, I'm not sure about uh, Shockwave, um, but uh, right now you can buy an extra Iron High and put it in another Bumblebee figure. That would be cool, you know. And uh, the projection, they look so well in the dark, so you might want to do that with your Bumblebee figure. Uh, so, just in case, get an extra uh, Iron High. Uh, for this one, if you want to if you want to install it into a, a sound wave figure, you can do that at, uh, as well. It's gonna be like a fun gimmick. Yeah. So uh, anyway, uh, I highly recommend these two. If you can still find it at your local Burger King uh, restaurant, go ahead and pick uh, these two up. And if you like what I said, go ahead and uh, pick up an extra Iron High for an extra fun activities. So. There you go, I highly recommend this for all Transformer, Dark of the Moon or Transformer fans in general. And thanks for watching.